The SI joint or the sacroiliac joint is the joint between the sacrum bone and the ilium, which is a part of the pelvis. And the sacroiliac joint can become inflamed or unstable or degenerated in some patients, resulting in pain. There are non-surgical treatments for sacroiliac joint pain that can work in a certain subset of patients. That includes physical therapy, chiropractor treatment, injections or pain shots in the joint. But for those patients who don't get relief with those treatments, they are a good candidate for sacroiliac joint fusion. We make an incision, an approximately two centimeter incision on the lateral aspect of the patient's buttock. Through that incision, using x-ray guidance, we place three guide wires and then we place screws over those guide wires to stabilize and fuse the joint. The three screws that we place in the sacroiliac joints have slots in the center of them and we pack those with bone such that the slotted areas span the sacroiliac joint and we can actually get bone growth or bone effusion across the joint through those screws. The typical sacroiliac joint procedure that I'm doing takes approximately 45 minutes to an hour. Patients usually spend a night in the hospital after surgery. They have restrictions for the first 12 weeks or so after surgery, bending and, and lifting restrictions. I can't even describe in words how great it is to see people improve after this surgery and other surgeries that we do in neurosurgery for pain.